So what you're looking at here is an emergency extraction. It's not the real deal, but it is really real realistic. And that is part because it is a training exercise for high school firefighter cadets. Paula Tutman takes us to a program that could turn local students into highly sought after firefighters across the country. These are students who are actually part of a firefighting academy, gaining real knowledge and fire experience while simultaneously earning high school and college credits. This is a great uh, culmination of our whole year. The students in EMT have learned all their medical skills and the firefighters have learned all their firefighting skills, including vehicle extrication. So today we're going to do a simulated drunk driving um, crash. The long and short of it is you just can't raise your hand and say, I want to be a firefighter. It takes hard work and specialized training. This class is actually a fire cadet program. We actually get to learn more with it. Like we use the trucks, we use the fire hydrants. We go over more scenarios. We can also like uh, simulate plane, fire, house fires. The students will graduate with EMT, Firefighter 1, Firefighter 2, and Hazardous Materials Operations Training. Now, if you don't know what all of those credentials mean, just ask any fire chief out there hungry for young, strong, eager bodies interested in the fire service. Yeah, like Chief Brian Tyrell, the fire chief for the Washington Township Fire Department in northern Macomb County. We do want to try to recruit that those younger folks into this business so that we can sustain them and grow them over a 20, 25 year career. That's the the vision and that's the goal um, but there's just not enough people looking to get into our business um, for the open spots across Michigan. Every single skill taught in a regular fire academy is taught right here and these days most full-time professional fire departments transport more medical patients than fighting actual fires and so that EMT or emergency medical technician skill is big and highly sought after. I want to be um, a firefighter slash paramedic because um, I really want to help people uh, because when I help people, it fulfills me. I'm probably going to be working at Westland Fire Department right after school. And because this exhibition also served as real life lessons in what can happen when you drink and drive, not only were students showing off what they learned, but they were teaching their peers. I'm going to take that this one day could happen to me if I make the wrong decision of drinking and driving. Okay, so a whole lot of lessons being learned right there. I'm at the beautiful brand new Washington Township Fire Station 3. It still has that shiny penny new car smell. The chief here is excited about a program like this, as well as chiefs everywhere. All the chiefs I talk to say they love these kinds of programs. They need this talent, and they love the passion that these young people bring to this. Karen? What a great experience for those young people. Thank you, Paula. We appreciate it.